Hi there and welcome back. Um, so today I'm going to make um, three middle um, centre signature um, pockets. So the four, um, this journal, which is that one. Um, so I'm going to do one of them uh, with two envelopes, one with a bag and one with a 12 by 12. So I'm thinking the 12 by 12 of just literally, because it's only one sided and it's uh, light paper, it's not like a uh, card. So I was thinking of just folding it up and folding it up. Like so, would need cutting down a little bit. So let's cut it down to to a better um, size. So if I do it at five, so then it'll be ten across. So this is twelve by twelve. Yeah, and I think I'll just cut the top off just to make it a little bit uh, smaller. Okay, um, I will put the thumb holes in the middle. So if I just grab the middle, like so. And then all I'm going, well, I'm going to cover that and then I will just glue uh, across the, the top. And then we've got, you know, two, two pockets. So... I can go in there. What can I put in here? Um, I've got some of these papers just to the side of me. I'll show you what's on the uh, tray in a minute. So if I just cut these in in half and put it across there, it'll um, give it a bit more um, strength and it'll cover cover that hole up so I'll just glue around there I'm using the Kalal okay that's one and that's the other uh, the scrapbook paper that I'm using is from die cuts with a view um, I forget what the pad's called. It is in my um, Amazon favourites under, uh, I think, paper pads. So that's that's the inside. Um, let me get my ink and do around here. Quick to it all the all the way around. And I thought we could just, um, well, the insides of these, I think I'm going to keep them plain because they could be wrote on uh, with it being lined. And the outside, I thought I'd do uh, a collage. So I don't know how much time I'll have, um, you know, because I'm going to be doing six collages. So I'll, you know, go to about 40, 40 minutes and then... Um, You'll be able to see the the more when I do the flip through of, of the book. It's only going to be a really simple journal. Um, the old exercise really was for me to um, use a hardback uh, book and uh, put three signatures in it. So. I just wanted to see how I'd get on with it. So the next time I do one, um, I'll do it, you know, a bit more um, in depth. So I'm just cutting the end off that bag and I'm going to cut this end off as well because it's only, um, you know, one, one thick. So that'll make two smaller pockets. Okay, and then the envelope, I'm just going to glue that into there, so 
clay, pot of clay. I think these are probably six by four um, envelopes. Okay, so that's glue in, and then I'll glue this in. Sorry about my bracelet jangling. Um, I will cover the back, I think, off screen because I have actually got to print some, some papers out. I've only uh, really got autumnal ones or I might use my scraps to collage um, the back of it. But again, I'll do that, do that off screen. So we don't have to do any more gluing, no more cutting. Um, all we do, because this is going to be a pocket, so... I need to take these ends off. Okay, I'll just get that with my uh, scissors. So that's those opened up, and again, I'll do it from the middle. Ooh. No, I wait till I wait till I've collaged um, over it. Okay, so now we've done all the cutting. Um, so I'm just going to pause and ink uh, around these. Okay, I have to cut the envelope down um, a little bit because it was too wide. So on my tray, um, I've got some frames which were from Tapeology. So I've got a couple of frames, they ink up lovely. I've got a couple of um, postage stamps, browns and greens. Um, I've got a couple of birds, which are greens and, and browns. Um, I've got some ferns, stickers. Then I've got these beautiful uh, green papers, which was in my latest uh, Tapeology box. I've uh, these little um, ticket book and this is vellum um, little bits. They was from uh, your creative studio box. Uh, some little uh, papers. I think these was from a bunjo or they might have been from Tapeology. And this like little collage uh, book. And I think that was from your creative studio. So that's what I've got um, to decorate with. I'm thinking first I'll have a look at the, the frames. If I was to use uh, this big one, it would have to go on here. So I was thinking of like having a bird, having that coming out. I actually really like that this one. Um, oh, this might be a bit more colourful. No, I liked I like the first one. Why don't I just go with that? Yeah, I'm going with that. So that's going to be like my main uh, visual on that one. Um, that would probably be nice on on that one. Um, have a look. I don't have to put birds on each of them. I could have uh, a fern and then some postage stamps uh, there. So yeah, I think that would be, be nice. And then this one could either go... No, it's a bit nothing here on there. I do love the birds in front of the frames. If you was, have been with me for a while, I did go through a stage, oh I love that, of doing a uh, bird collage with these frames. So that's going to be um, my my fronts. So we've already inked that. We're going to have to ink uh, the frame and the bird. So let me show you how nicely these do, do ink up. You think, oh crikey, all that white. But actually, it's nice having all that white because then you can uh, grunge it up whatever colour colour you want. These are stickers. Uh, they're like a, a vinyl. They're quite thick 
um, stickers, really nice stickers. Okay, just try and get in that corner. So that's that inked up. And we'll do this lovely bird. I'm trying to think what bird it is. And I do know it, I just can't, can't think what it is. I've just gone through my um, birds and I've pulled some out uh, to put in because um, I'm getting my tray ready, um, you know, for the fall uh, projects. Um, and there was some on with, you know, um, brown leaves and stuff. So I think I'm going to have it more off to, to the side like so. So let's get some, some papers um, down. So if I go with this, I want it down that side. That would be nice. I don't think I'm going to need to put um, loads on. I'm liking um, the lines behind it. Yeah, I do like that. I think I'm just going to round this a little bit because I would like to see um, the lines through that. So I'm going to I'm going to stick it down. I so I don't have to collage, you know, lo loads of papers <coughs> on. Um, and just keep it keep it simple. So if you're not, um, you know, if you're new to collage, um, you know, don't think you've got to do layers upon layers of of different things. Just just an edge somewhere, you know, just with some ripped ripped paper on gives it a nice a nice look so pop that there and I think I'm gonna have some just some text um going across the top these mixed paper packs are so handy uh, for collage it saves a lot of printing out and having you know loads of folders of, of paper yeah i'm gonna have that going across there i could use the glue stick but i haven't really got room on my table to have um a glue book out so that can go there then let's have a look at These are going to want like cutting out, aren't they? I mean, I could put the whole thing. I don't really think that green goes quite like that brown or beigey. Let's um, just quickly cut this down. This is nice paper, it's quite thick. Layers together, and then I can get the little bit. Okay. So where do where do I want that? Yeah, so I'm going to put the frame down uh, next. We'll do the fronts of all of them and see, um, you know, what, what time um, we're on. And at least you, we can see what, what they all uh, look like. These are very, very sticky. So make sure you've got it where you want it. Lovely. That's 
going to go there. So I'm going to stick, stick the bird down. I'll try to got my heart glitter out. Put me art glitter into this bottle. I don't know how it's going to act in here. Oh. Surprisingly, it's um I thought I would have to mess about and um you know put the pin through it. I did put a pin somewhere so they'd I'd have one on my desk. Oh I can see it. Okay, I just off to the side a little bit. No. I have that one because um, the feathers underneath is, is that colour. So that is the first one. Yeah, I could have a word or something um, up the top, but I like that how it is. So I'll leave that to to dry let's do uh, this one i'm going to pause and ink around everything okay so everything's inked up thinking i'll get that bit uh used up from from the other one let's um maybe that green leaf one will be nice something okay those for the next one um <clears throat> Um, of the same in, in these packs. I can't see any. Um, I'll go for so I think I'm of popping that there. So let's um let's get these two two down. Lovely paper inks really really nice. This has got a nice uh, texture. It's a bit like the the linen paper. Same with this. I think it says cloth paper um on on the actual box. So what I'm gonna do is put some glue down this side and join join these together first yeah okay. so this will be the last green project uh, for for a while till after Christmas at least Should be going on to, to the browns and the reds and the oranges next. Okay, and then we'll pop that there. Let's just I don't know why I'm alternating glue, but I am. Melt, melt into 
to the other um, right hand. Okay, let's have a look what this frame looks like. So pop that there. I think this was on two, um, you know, on one page and on the other page. That's why it's got that got that break. So I feel like I, I want to fill um, that space in. So yes, I'm going to do that. Now, what I'm thinking is, sorry if I've just gone off screen, I'm just undoing this. These are pretty easy to, to undo as well with them being um, thick stickers. So that's up. So I'm thinking I'll pop that on there. Let's pop a bit of glue in that centre. Like so. Yep. Now, do I want to put like my ticket inside it? Ooh, that's a nice colour. Let's just, I'll try, just grab my tear roller, really. I think I still will get a small art glitter, so I've just got that pin, uh, you know, the small, small end, because um, it is very handy for pushing, pushing under things. I think it needs something um, across here, so I've got... far am I? No, I'm not too far off. And so I'm da down the bottom because obviously the tray, um, this is a sticker. Um, yeah, the tray obviously comes that far down. Okay. I think I'm going to take that off and glue it separately. So I'm going to pop that there. Let's make sure that. Yeah. So I'm just going to cut that, which would have been the centre. And then I can cover over that. So that's where it, it breaks like for, for the centre. Okay. So that's that one. Love them. Um, this one. So we've got uh, the fern. I shall ink around. Okay, <clears throat> so I've just had a flip through that book to see if there was anything um, green. And I think what I'm going to do to make this a bit more stable as well is just cover it um, with, with this paper. So it will look as if, you know, it's, it's all collaged. So if I put that um, down... 
Now this is a little bit greasy, but um, this bag, I wouldn't say it was like um, like a glass scene, but um, it's got that. So hopefully this glue will stay on. Let's do that. Okay. Then I'm going to pop the frame in the middle, or I might do it a bit to the top left. Let's have a look. Oops. Let's um, pop that there. Yep. Okay, okay, and then we'll pop that uh, there, like so. Oh, nice. I like that. Um, <coughs> do we want? Do we want a stamp? I like that to the to the edge. Oops. Okay, I'm going to ink around the perimeter because I didn't didn't really ink this. So we're not doing bad for time. So I'll do do the back of this one. I'm going to keep the. The middles um well i think i'm just going to stick some writing paper um in the the middles so let's see if we've got a small small bird okay so i've got these i think that's a good good size um I think I'll centre um, this. Just trying to use up, up the bits that, that have started. So lots of little bits left over. So that can go there. Let me ink around this side. I put some glue down at that side then I can just catch catch that there and then I've got this one oh that's nice yeah I'm gonna do that so if I stick stick that down I'm not bothered about inking every single uh, piece. I do, I do like some inked and some some not inked. I just think it it gives it a bit of a different a different look. Then, okay. Um, should I use the clamp and say 
I'm going to have to keep remembering this is art glitter. Um, and obviously it's coming out a lot faster than it would in the small bottle, which means I'll be using loads. Uh, and as you'll know, it's, it's not the cheapest of, of glues. Right, so I like that. Now, I feel like I want something. What about one of these vellum sheets? Yeah, I'm going to pop that on. I feel like I want a circle. So they're not very thick, these ones. I think this bird is out of one from a Nanina Collage type. Or do I want it more? Yeah, I like it there. Okay. And let's use that colour. Do with something green. Ink, <coughs> ink around that so I think I'll pause and just grab um, my plain folder what's got plain paper in and then I might as well put the plain paper in the middle and then that's this one uh, done so yeah I love that okay so I've just stuck some plain paper um, in the middle and I'm just going to put one of these smaller fern stickers down at the bottom yeah yeah I'll just cut cut that off rather than try and lift it lift it up okay so that's one done I'll leave that open over there so I'll do the back of this one so in here, I think I might put, just put a couple of uh, stumps together. Okay, and then I'll put that one there. I've got quite a bit of glue on my fingers, so it's a little bit difficult. Okay, so that's the centre of that one. Right, so I think 
of one of the, the ferns at the back. And uh, no, it's too green, isn't it? Um, what can I do? Ooh, I don't have to go a little bit. A little bit like that. Right, let's I'm rip it top and bottom. Kind of go in through through the middle like that. Um <coughs> Um, ink, ink this up. There, put that on there. I don't know what. What that looks like. Oop. Oh yeah, I like that. So I'm gonna clear this down back to the colour. I think I'm going to have, <coughs> excuse me, um, a little bit of a ticket and stump cluster in that middle, oh, bottom corner, that's that, um, I'm just going to put that there and that's that one done because obviously that's got uh, lines through the middle anyway. So that's his back, that's his front and this one. So I've got a frame but that's, that's a funny, funny colour that is. Well, I've got on there a bird. I want to put a, a fern man. So, I think that one's the same kind of fern. I wonder if something I like a lot. I think that's the same as well. Similar. Mm. 
Mm. I don't know. I'm feeling like this is quite quite big, so I think a bird would um, would be better. That's way too long. Okay, like so. Yeah, I'm liking that. I like the colours. So I've got that join um, there. So if I use this um, scrap from uh, the plain, plain paper. So we'll put that there. Okay, what else have we got? Got this, which can go down at that bottom. So let me ink this edge and this back edge. And I'll probably put this kind of paper in, in the middle. And they can all be, all be right in spots. that was not straight okay that's better um what else have I got oh some more tags pop that there So, I might just pop that there just to join, join the two of them. That's used on me. <laughs> All the spots are. Bit of leaf there, just put that in. Yeah, do that there. Right. I don't think I'm going to rip any more papers up because I've used them all, aren't I? So that's really good. Um, so let's put. of these vellums on. I'm going to do it with the art glitter. Bring it forward a little bit. That's that. I think what I'll do is I'll have some washi tape down there just to get a bit more uh, green into it. Like so. And then I want that out there. Okay, let's just get some glue under that vellum. Now I'm half thinking, do I want a foot? No, I don't. Oh, I'm liking that. 
Okay, so that way it doesn't, uh, yeah. I could put the window there. Let's have a look what that looks like inked, because it'll save me putting it away. I must um, re-ink my um, inks, I've not done them for a while. Okay, so that goes like that. And then I think I want something down here. Yeah, I like the fan down on that. Oops. I'm going to stick that bit, bit on. Okay. Put all this bit off. Lovely. It's like melted. Melted into the background. Let's move that because I can see that it's um, shining. Yeah. I think the birds, what I've got left, I think I'm going to put those in my um, autumn uh, box because they're those kinds of colours, aren't they? So that there, I think it may be, sink this, see what. This is just a faux, faux stamp. It's probably from a, your creative studio box. Oh, I like that there. Let's pop that there. Like so, and that's that's that. Yeah, love them. Um, and then this one, um, I'll obviously have to be careful um, around there because I want to keep that that open. So, ooh. I might put that on because I can do it in in a patch pack oh patchwork. So if I just glue here and then down here, I don't want to glue right into the centre because obviously this is going to be the centre of the um, journal, or well, the, the signature. So that's that. That side will want cutting, cutting off. Let's see, Let's see what else I've got in my folder of plainness. Oh, that's um, some of the green. What was left from from the Victoria Design Kit? So if I put that on there, and then I'll put the the green on there and then I'll just cut round it so I shall say uh, bye um, I think I'll put a fern in inside um, and possibly a couple of stamps uh, up there so that's the three um, insides of, of the signature so with this one and this one and then this one.
okay so i will be back tomorrow i'm gonna get um all the journal cards and tags made um and then yeah this is this is about about done because like i say i'm gonna keep it really uh simple um and yeah so thank you very much for joining me and i will see you oh i'll see you later because it's saturday that you'll see this so yeah we'll be making tags later <laughs> so thanks for joining me Bye for now.